All right, guys, I'm back. It's the 1st of January, 1734. Our infamy's kind of low. I'm not really patient enough to let it go any lower. <laughs> this will let us get 10 states at this point, which is fine, because we only need four here. And uh, we only need, what, even we could do with one here, but I'd probably take these four. And maybe these two. So there's 10 right there. If we take all that and bleach just stand, that's 10. So let's get this war started, huh? Trebizond, do we need allies? Of course we're gonna, of course they're gonna join us. So Trebizond, Brunei, Persia, and Morocco. deal with them whenever. I'm not going to bother. Persia. Ugh. I mean, they've already rebuilt a lot of their army. It could be a big threat, actually. Hmm. Well, big threat with quotes on it, because they don't really have the military uh, technology to deal with us, but whatever. Alright, so we've got our war. We've got our blood... Invade on all fronts. There is no retreat. There is only invade. Let's go. And where's our navies? There's one. Go over here. Actually, go over here. They're going to Cape Vaughn in three days. So let's slow down time and wait for them to get closer. And then we'll undock. Oh, looks like they changed the positioning. Yeah, they're going to Polar. They're going to dock up. Damn it. Oh well. Good invasion is always good. So who joined anyway? Trebizond and Yemen. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that. Mali, Pisa, Iraq, and Conan Borno. Uh, we need to take Iraq at some point. I mean, that's just... Whatever. Persia's by itself, and Baluchistan's by itself. Okay. So Brunei did not wind up joining the war. That's fine by me. This is our... This is our king, by the way. Our... Lord Protector. Because I want him to die, because the diplomacy is terrible, so I have him fighting in battles. Alright, let's see if we can catch this guy. He's trying to run. No, no, we're going to get there the day before he leaves. Awesome. Oh, yeah. That worked out much better with smaller navy. Oh, even Albania is kicking some Moroccan navy ass. I like it. Let's build.
build some shit while we're waiting. Level 1 forts? No. Special buildings? No. Alright. Fucking level four forts. Uh, another general, please. Oh, I can't. I think you don't need a general. So you get him. Oh, hello, Trebizond. There should be a stable government. Lose tech investment or lose stability? We'll lose the tech investment. Oh. And we get there today before he gets there. Awesome! Wow, you're a little late to the party, Mr. Boatman. We'll send you over here. Ah, they're all level 4. Everything is now a level 4 fort. So lame. Even Baluchistan is invading. <laughs> Epic. Oh, we engage their navies. And we defeated that army in Azerbaijan, that's good. We defeated that army in Gafsa, that's also good. to destroy more armies. But let's go with this one first, because they're smaller. And it takes a long time to walk from Kerman to Zaydan and from Sindh to Indus. That is a ridiculously long time. We've actually fought several battles in the time that it's taken them just to walk from one state to the next. Oh, it's level four. God damn it. Why'd it have to be level four? Seriously. There's a level three down here. Let's do level three first. These are both level three. Good. And we destroyed that Moroccan navy, but we lost one ship. God damn it. Not allowed to lose ships, damn it. Actually, it doesn't matter. We have so many. Who cares? Dock everyone up in Tangiers for now just to heal because they have low morale or organization or something. Kill that army. Killed that army 
very good. still have this navy here, which is actually very imposing, but we shall deal with it. You know what? We don't even have to. Why am I trying to slaughter my own ships? We don't even have to fight that navy. All we have to do is stay out of its way. this war on the ground anyway. Oh, fucking rebels. And that army is destroyed. Excellent. Alright, so we can annex them for infamy. Bye bye, Trebizond. And we can now... Hold on. Stop hunting rebels, please. Stop hunting rebels. Okay. So let's go invade Persia, shall we? have to think, what actually lands do we want from them? Let's look at trade map mode. Wool, wool, wool. Spices would be nice. Wool, fish... Wool, wool, wool. Grain, 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 grain. Spices. Wool, wool, wool. Wool, wool. All they have is wool. They have a lot of wool. And salt. Well, the salt's nice, but... I think the definite thing we should do is cut them off right here. Take these two so they at least won't be able to link up their lands. The more separated they are, the weaker they are. So, don't need to bother taking any of this. Although maybe we, maybe we should take Shervan. Just in case Muscovy goes to war with them, they won't be able to take these four if we take Shervan. Okay, let's go do that. Let's take Shervan, and then we'll focus on this area. Fail sieged. Damn. Wow, 
Why must you fail siege? Ah, here we go. Minus six penalty. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Ah, look at that. They took Messina. Well, already then. I guess we can take Messina. Although it is a level 4. Okay, guys. Let's go. Where's my transports over here? Oh, it's only 15. Hmm. No, we'll just have to slow boat it. You can go back to Surat. How dare you fail siege. We're in the middle of a war and you're fail sieging. I dare say we're doing pretty decently against Morocco. And that army is dead. Hooray! Now let's go kill this army and finish the siege because this army sucks. Oh look, Morocco wants peace. What do they want, white peace? Hmm. That's a tough call, Morocco. You sure know how to drive a bargain, but I think we'll pass on your whole peace thing. Probably build some shits. Oh, hello, Morocco. What's up? You're running to. Oran and Atlas. I don't mind splitting my forces at all. That army's destroyed. I 
And that army is destroyed as well. I dare say we're making good progress right now. Or are we at peace with them? Oh, I guess that war is over. I didn't even notice. Oh god, it's Molly. Molly is invading. Whatever will we do? Oh right, we'll stomp their face and laugh. Armies destroyed. Yes, 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 we built a bunch of shit. I get it. Looks like Iraq is actually about to take Mosul. Oh no. How about peace? Oh look, peace. Who else can we peace out? Pisa, Mali, and Conum Borno. Well, Pisa. Nope. How about Mali and Conum Borno? Mali can't. Oh, they're both vassals of Morocco. Well, damn it. Head this way. Actually, let's head this way. No, no, like this. There you go. Alright, so we can annex Baluchistan for eight infamy for four states. Sounds good. Look at that. Oh, we're so close to connecting our lands. Look how close we are. Fuck you, Rajputana. Fuck you. I'm assuming you guys are bent over backwards for peace. Yeah, they would accept all that. Oh, they wouldn't accept Oran. Oh no, man, Oran is special to us, yo. 14 infamy. We can't even take 14 infamy, Jesus. You guys have too much land, Morocco. Every time we take land from Morocco, they just expand further into, into Western Africa. So they wind up with more shit we have to take. Every time we go to war with them.
Level 5? Holy shit. Yeah, I don't think we need to be sieging any level 5s today. It's not exactly on the, the menu. destroyed. Would you guys like peace now that your arms is destroyed? Oh, sorry, we can't. Hmm. We should get something and get out of this war. So that we can focus on Persia. Alright, so this is really all I wanted was to link up our lands, right? It's only eight. We could do that right now. Think of our lands. Everyone would be happy. Yes, we wouldn't have this, and we wouldn't have this and this, but we would link up our lands. So let's just do that. Maybe make you get rid of a core on some shit. Alright, let's do it. There we go. Very nice, very nice. We linked up our African lands. And we're still under the infamy limit. Barely. West Phelan. Where am I going to put you? Uh, I guess we can put you over here, Constantine. No, we already have an army for Constantine. Well, shit. Let's put him on the boat. Uh, where's our fourth army? There it is. Munster. Well, you need a better place to live than Munster. Why don't you start rolling this way? We'll put you to use, man. Well, I mean, we can go to war with Persia anytime we want because they have no allies. So maybe we should just take this one state that we wanted, Shervan, and get out. Because we can also go to war with them later. Yeah, let's just do it. Get out of this war. Get rid of your cores and my shit. Beautiful. Beautiful. Little cash never hurt. There we go. So they'll give us 925 gold. We'll take two infamy, which is fine. And we'll get Shervan, which will stop Muscovy from taking these states right here. And we made him get rid of a ton of cores. I love it. So we're at peace again, and we have tons of infamy again. <laughs> ah, well. Yeah, we should send a missionary there now. Back on Hunt Rebels. You can go back on Hunt Rebels as well. Uh, Yasuj and Hamdan. Oh, you're still hunting Rebels. That's fine. Yasuj, I think we'll change you to Hormuz. Yeah. And yeah, we're one step closer to taking... Uh, or connecting our Indian lands with our Arabian lands, Persian lands. Oh, that'll be nice. And let's start converting these guys as well.
we'll get to Africa and Trebizond eventually, but first these. Ah, Revolt in Samoa. Come on. How can there be a thousand people revolting in Samoa? There's only like a thousand people living there. Jesus. Where did they find guns for a thousand people when the community only has a thousand people total? Come on. Be reasonable. Alright, where do I want to put this army? It really is a superfluous army. Aleppo, you can go back to Aleppo. I'm ready, same thing. find a place for it. But, in the meantime, uh, I think I can end this video <laughs> for now. So, uh, yeah, we made some decent expansion there. We took about 20 infamy, maybe 22 infamy. Took four states here, two states here, uh, four states here, and this state. So yeah. Good progress. We linked up some more lands and we're almost ready to link up India. So yep. Next for Germany is probably a war with Rajputana and that would probably mean wars with all of Asia. But there's always the possibility of going towards France and Iberia. It's possible. And Muscovy has a lot of land we could expand into. I don't know. We'll take a look at our options. We still got about 80 years left in the game, so plenty of time. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed our time together today. And please join us next time, where we continue being douchebags to the whole world.